over there. Miss Foxtrot, no. We can't go on another educational adventure right now. River needs our help. Look, I know it's risky, but if we try hard, we can get her back safely. Yeah, we just need to believe in ourselves or something. And I think you're just trying to protect yourself. No, 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 don't listen. This is Salomon August Andre of Sweden. Resourceful, eternally optimistic, and a total failure. <laughs> Hi there. I'm gonna fly a hot air balloon from Svalbard over the North Pole to Canada. Or maybe Russia. Both work. He's not sure? Well, you can't steer balloons. I can. My balloon will drag dozens of long ropes along the ground, slowing it enough that we can use sails to change course. All aboard! <laughs> Come on, gang, hop on the balloon. <laughs> Hands and feet inside the basket. <laughs> Just kidding, you can put your feet up. Uh, oh. Up, up, and away! It's fine. <laughs> it's, it is fine now. It wasn't. Andre immediately lost his only method of steering, and he unloaded so much weight that the balloon shot up to an altitude of 700 meters. Ah, ah. At that height, hydrogen escaped even more quickly, and ice crossed it onto his balloon. No! Ah. <laughs> Get used to it. With no equilibrium, Andre rose and fell for two days straight. Everything's going great. We're all gonna die! Okay, compromise. Let's say we've had some ups and downs. <laughs> Boom! Ah! was forced to hike back to civilization. First, he went southeast. Eastward ho! But he was on an ice flow drifting the opposite direction. He actually traveled backward. He then converted his balloon into a raft and set sail to the southwest instead. Westward ho! But the wind changed directions almost immediately. By September 12th, two months after his initial departure, Andre decided to camp through the winter on an ice floe and let the drift carry him wherever it would. Wherever! Ho! Less than a month later, the ice broke apart under his encampment, forcing him to relocate to solid ground. Even still, Andre remained relentlessly upbeat. Here's what he wrote about himself and his two companions. Morale remains good. With such comrades, one should be able to manage under, I may say, any circumstances. See? He and his friends looked out for each other. They were dead within days! Ah, uh, that sucks. Come on! See? If you try hard, believe in yourself, and stay positive, you can still fail and die. But he was also hasty, stupid, and unprepared. We can't knowingly abandon River. Yeah! Yes, we can. I'll show you. <laughs> if you liked that episode of WTF 101, I have good news. There's way more of it on Dropout. Dropout is the new premium, ad-free, and uncensored comedy platform from College Humor. Go to dropout.tv and start your free trial today. <laughs> and don't worry about me. I'm fine. Nah, this is all gonna turn out fine. I feel safe. Ho ho! How's everyone enjoying the wondrous land of Caledonia? Um, yeah.